I'm sorry for the long intros. Uh, I might just have to start putting up a timestamp on where the actual videos start for some of my subscribers who would rather just watch the video and skip the intro. So I'm okay with that, but I don't think I'll be able to stop having such long intros. It's just going to be difficult for me. It's going to be a bit out of character. So I'm sorry to all the guys who would rather not have me talk as much as I do. I'll leave a timestamp so you can move on to the actual DIY enjoy this one again you guys and my daughter is just enjoying it so 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 much hello everything hello everything i'm back again um i've been gone for quite a while for about a month now but i've been busy busy with school busy with work and also busy with this DIY. I'm sure you've guys seen from the caption that this is an industrial or grid mirror, a paneled mirror. I've seen it re being referred to those names. I am so excited over this DIY. It has worked out beyond my imagination. It's moment one of my proudest DIYs following the headboard. And with that being said, I want to thank you guys for engaging so much on my headboard video and inquiring about where to get the materials and ev and everything that has also made me realize that i have to put up a list of the materials that i used as well as the prices and the places that i got the materials from with this video i am definitely gonna do that and there wasn't a lot of materials used but i now accept that i have to put out every detail and not miss anything to avoid you guys asking the same question over and over again i hope you guys will be able to go back to the headboard video and see where i got the materials from how much they cost everything that has to do with that um video i am still in awe of what i am able to achieve I'd still push myself toward what I would like to accomplish and this is one of those projects that took me a while to finish because I had a bit of a glitch and I did a stupid mistake somewhere there. Fixed it up very quickly and I'm very, I'm, I'm just beyond happy with the outcome of this DIY and I hope you guys will too because I feel like that headboard video has made me realize that you guys actually like or enjoy the bigger DIY projects. So I'm going to lean more towards that because I see it has really, really picked your interest. And I mean, you must just give the people what they want. Give the people what they want. And I am all about that. So I will be sharing more bigger DIYs with you guys. The small ones will just be there. To just keep you guys going while I am busy with the bigger ones. So stay tuned for my next DIY. But so long. Let's get on to this video. I keep looking there because that's where the mirror is. Hope you guys enjoy it. Enjoy the video. Just don't forget to like, to comment and to subscribe. If you are a new viewer, make sure to subscribe you guys. I am now over a hundred subscribers and i'm super super grateful and thankful for that so see you guys in my next video bye 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 uh, 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 uh. <laughs> i can't dance to save my life peace out
for this video you guys and i hope you enjoy it you get to try your own you get your own you get your own mirror mirror oh mirror oh mirror oh mirror oh mirror Oh Mira. Oh Mira. <laughs> so I don't need to share this, but next up this room will be the brightest room you get to see because I'm gonna be painting it white. Hmm? White. I wanna be living in light because I be spreading light. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much. Bye.